guys welcome back to my channel my name is Ashley and if this is your first time here make sure you do subscribe on the bottom of this video and make sure you do follow me on my social media makeup artist 27 you can comment down below if you want and yes make sure you do click the bell notification so you can get the notifications when I do upload the new videos and before you leave make sure you do give it a thumbs up like this video alrighty so on today's video it's gonna be pretty pretty different from my other videos I think this is my first hair tutorial or hair routine let's call it hair routine and I'm gonna be showing you guys the steps I do for a successful curly hair day night out so if you do want to watch the steps just make sure you do continue to watch alrighty so the first thing I did is I washed my hair why did I wash it with so personally I bought this kit um, I use Diva Curl products um, sometimes I use other products but the most I have is Diva Curls and I get the Diva hair I get the Diva haircut too which is in three weeks I'm excited um, so yeah, this is the super curly hair because if you see my hair, it's like super, super curly. So I use this. What do I do when I, like I took a shower and I use the, see, we use the Zero Ladder Ultra Moisturizing Milk Cleanser. Um, this is a cleanser conditioner uh, and it's amazing. Like, I don't, Diva Curl doesn't use it doesn't believe in shampoos they use cleansers so I use this you go in the shower you put it on you cleanse your hair really well take it off done um, the next step is the ultra moisture milk conditioner this is a conditioner you can leave it on for two to three minutes I believe um, how I use it apply conditioner to wet hair and use your fingers to turn your hair and yeah you can leave it on for a little bit or you can I just leave it on for a little bit because I like conditioner and I leave some like I don't wash it all off but today I didn't do that so I didn't even put conditioner because I wanted to use it with you guys so what I do I bought this bottle in Amazon it's amazing and I just like the one of the tips they give you when you do the diva curl is that your hair must be wet like when you take a shower don't dry your hair um, I usually wrap it off with my diva curl um, towel um, and I don't like I don't go like this I just leave it as it is I just wrap it I don't do anything I just I maintain it like wet if not then I use if it's dries then I use the spray so what I do I, I have this spray and since I <laughs> and since I like was getting ready to film like it, it dried a little bit so I just make sure it's like all wet make sure it's like wet the good thing about this spray is just it's like you see how I don't know if you can see but it's not like a pointy spray that is it's like like it oh, like it just like spreads all over and I like it it doesn't make like a mess or anything which I like so I just do I just wet it a little bit now I'm just gonna brush it because it's like pretty messy right now and I use the wet brush um, pro from yeah wet brush pro you can find these in Ulta or Sally and the good thing is like it doesn't damage the hair like usually when you do curls you like yeah this one is just it runs so easy on the curl like you see like I don't have no trouble at all and that is what I like like sometimes it will be trouble if it's like dry but it's not so that's what I I like about this brush and I love it it's like my lifesaver because believe me the shit eats Alrighty, so it is done. I feel it like pretty wet. I have 
and of course you're gonna have hair like loss everywhere I do lose a lot of hair especially since like curls like you'll see a bunch of hair alrighty so what I'm gonna do it's I'm gonna take a little bit of the, con the conditioner which is this one um, just moisture my curls it's a little bit but look, this is what I take and I just put it on my fingers and I just go like that I run it from like the top to the end because you want to have that those curls moisture 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 and I just use my fingers I don't use a brush most of the time I just use my fingers it's better it doesn't damage your hair just go, the good thing is like I have nails so I just go like this <laughs> And just make sure you do wet. Keep wetting it because you need it to be wet. If not, it's not going to do anything. Alrighty. What I'm going to use next is I have here a leave in conditioner, which is it's the same thing as the ultra moisturizing leave in conditioner. This one was just conditioner, milk conditioner. This one I just take a little bit, tiny bit. Look, just a tiny bit, and I just put it through my hair, just a little bit, nothing crazy, and then, and I use the towel always to clean my hands, alrighty, um, and then we have the coconut curl styler, this is what we have, um, so this brings four products for $42 and it brings the shampoo, not the shampoo, the cleanser, the conditioner, and it also brings the living conditioner and the super cream coconut curl styler, which is what I like to use preferably. Like usually I like to style it. Um I have a bunch of like like um trial sizes because when I go out of on a trip then i'll use this ones because you can travel with those so i usually buy the mini kit which is like 20 something bucks and you can take these so on this i have the curl definer i have which is different from the coconut curl which i like more the this is a styling cream this is called the super cream which is the coconut coral styler I'm gonna go with the coconut today and then I have the light defining gel which it's almost gone I need to buy a big one so what we're gonna do today okay I keep wetting it because we need to wet it you need to wet it you need to wet it okay next I'm gonna go ahead and apply the coconut curl styler so this is one I but it does, it's like, oh Jesus, why is it not? Okay, it doesn't want to cooperate with me. Okay. Alright, so look what I grab. I don't put a lot. Like, just put it through your fingers. And you just run it on the hair. Put it on the ends, go through your fingers. And this is what I do. Like, I just go with my fingers. Make sure you put all of it in the back too. Like, this is what I do. Then, since usually um, I go on the sink, not the sink, not the sink, you know the bathroom sink, and I just go like that to the water and I wet it and I go like this. So, since I'm not in the sink, I'm just gonna wet it with the spray. Because you need a lot of water. Like, you need it to drip. It needs to drip water. So, I just put it like that. And I brush it down. And I go like that. It needs to. Like, it's not going to drip a lot of water because <laughs> I'm not on the sink. But that's what I usually do. And I just crunch it like that. And then to go back, I try not to flip it. I just go around like this. 
and I just like move it with my hands okay so you see it's already getting like those curls and now I'm gonna take um, the light gel which doesn't have a lot so <laughs> I'm going like this because it doesn't have a lot same thing I just a little bit and I just put it like that put it on the front like this I use my fingers to brush it and then I just wet it And then you're just gonna crunch it like you have to crunch it I, I don't know if you can I, it's dropping water right now I have the towel in front of me with this dripping water which is good there's one more product I'm gonna go get and then we'll be almost done so let me go ahead and get it so I'm just gonna flip my hair again. I'm not gonna touch it. I'm gonna get another product and I'll be right back. Alrighty, I am back. Wait, you see how it's already bouncy? I love it. So I am back. The last product I always put is the Be Living Miracle Curl Plumper. Um, this is for texture and volume and because I want my curls to be a little bit like up not just like down I like it like with volume like afro type um, I take a little bit of this it's very sticky I don't like like the texture of it but I just take a little bit I don't know if you can see and I just flip my hair again down oh no <laughs> I don't do it down I actually like to um, go like this because you have to extend the curls like that like out so this is one side. I'm gonna take a little bit for the other side. And just send it like that. Right? Like you have to stand it. Alright, so now that we're done, what I do now is I flip my hair. Bring it all the way down. Let's wet it a little bit more. And what I like to do, I take the towel. I'm gonna get up a little bit so you guys can see. You can see there, yeah. So you just crunch it with the towel like that. Are able to see I'm trying to like show you guys okay that thing that's good nothing crazy I'm going like really fast so you're gonna flip your hair and then where I want the division I usually do it on this side like here right and curly hair is just like messy like most of the time so I just see how like I don't make like doesn't have to be like a straight line. I just do it with my nail, like that. Make sure everything is like on that side. I usually let it like air dry, or I do a little bit of like diffuser, and good to go. I'm just gonna go a little bit of diffuser, let it air dry, and then I'll come back and I'll show you guys like the finished touch with makeup and everything because I'm about to do my makeup too so let's see so let's air dry
Alrighty guys, I am back. I finished my makeup because I'm going out. But you guys can see now how the hair looks after all the applications. I feel it like a little bit of like the gel type texture, but it will go away um, and it will stay like super curly. So it's super super curly right now. I'm gonna like rotate a little bit so you guys can see it more. So see how it's like super curly from here. And I let it air dry because I don't do a lot of the diffuser. So you guys can see how it looks. It looks bomb. Later on, it will pick up a lot of the volume. So what I do for the volume, um, a little bit, I just put my like my nails in the bottom and I shake it up just to give it a little bit of more volume. It's like when you take the. Not the, like not the brush, but the other one. I can't think of it right now, but whatever. So I just like go like that to get a little bit of the volume. But you guys can see, you see how like if how simple I do my hair. Just make sure you, when you do part the products, just put water, water and like squeeze, it, squeeze, squeeze it like that. You have to see that water drip, and it's just you will see a difference and like the curls like as soon as I started doing that it was amazing as soon as I did my last haircut it's such a big difference that girl like oh uh, she's amazing and I'm gonna go in three weeks and I can't wait to see more results with the curls but yeah guys um bonus products I use also I'm gonna show you three products I use which I need to restock though um, three products I use from diva curls is first I use the heaven in hair um, divine deep conditioner this product is amazing like you will love it I love this this I use it um, before I apply any products sometimes I use a little bit I mix it with water and then you're good to go like it's amazing um yes you can use this before applying anything just mix it with water a little bit not too much because it's a lot of it's just to give it a little bit of moisture to your hair and mix it with water squeeze it you know the drill but this is amazing and it smells you see you see how gone that is like i use this baby a lot next product we have is the super stretch coconut curl in lung in elongator elongator something like that i bought this to try it out it was a new product that was released a couple months a couple, like maybe a year ago i don't know um it is really really good to um i don't know i don't see the difference when it if it makes it more longer i will have to try it out more but it's a good i don't it's a good good um hair hair um uh, and longer it defines and controls so maybe it will define it more than actually makes it longer but i like this too and it smells like coconut then the last product i use is the melt into moisture um this is a matcha butter conditioner mask um this is also a good product so what i use what how do i condition my hair or mask i use this and then i use the twist um technique so you take like your hair and you put the cream i usually put it in like a small cup put like almond drops or any kind of drops i buy i have like three different oils so i put almond drop or avocado oil i use any i mix it with a spoon and then i put it on my hair and then i twist it like the tooth the twist so it will be two and then you just twist it twist it twist it to the end and do it through the whole your hair leave it on for a couple of hours um you can watch tv sit down watch some netflix come back and take it off and you'll see such a difference on your hair like it will be so soft and as soon as it dries out it will be like bouncy and like shiny and everything so i love this product just for like the mask with the oil it's amazing so yeah guys that is everything i hope you guys enjoy this little hair tutorial you guys got finally to see the diva curl routine i do with my hair i totally love it i love the products i love how it feels on my hair how 
big the difference is when I style it and everybody everywhere I go they're like oh my god I love your curls can I touch them like they're like they're so cute so yeah I love it just don't touch it too much because then it'll get messy and freezy so yeah thank you guys for watching the video I hope you guys like it this tutorial